Yosef, seeing that he had such favor, and that he was increasing in stature, thought it right to take him to learn his letters. And he handed him over to another teacher to be taught. And that teacher said to Joseph, What letters do you wish me to teach that boy? Joseph answered and said, First teach him the Gentile letters, and then the Hebrew. For the teacher knew that he was very intelligent, and willingly took him in hand. And writing for him the first line, which is A and B, he taught him for some hours. But Jesus was silent, and made him no answer. Jesus said to the master, If you are indeed a master, and if you indeed know the letters, tell me the power of the A, and I shall tell you the power of the B. Then his master was filled with fury, and struck him on the head. And Jesus was angry, and cursed him, and he suddenly fell down, and died. And Jesus returned home. And Joseph gave orders to marry his mother, not to let him go out of the court of his house. Many days after came another teacher, a friend of Joseph, and said to him, Hand him over to me, and I with much sweetness will teach him his letters. And Joseph said to him, If you are able, take him and teach him. May it be attended with joy. When the teacher had taken him, he went along in fear and in great firmness, and held him with exultation. And when he had come to the teacher's house, he found a book lying there, and took it and opened it, and did not read what was written in the book, but opened his mouth, and spoke from the Holy Spirit, and taught the law. And, indeed, all who were standing there listened to him attentively, and the master sat down beside him, and listened to him with pleasure, and entreated him to teach them more. And a great crowd being gathered together, they heard all the holy teaching which he taught, and the choice words which came forth from the mouth of him who, child as he was, spoke such things. And Joseph, hearing of this, was afraid, and running. Later, the master, where Jesus was, said to Joseph, No, brother, that I have received your child to teach him or train him, but he is filled with much gravity and wisdom. Lo, now, take him home with joy, my brother, because the gravity which he has, has been given him by the Lord. And Jesus, hearing the master thus speaking, became cheerful, and said, Lo, now, master, you have truly said. For your sake, he who is dead shall rise again. And Joseph took him home, 